everyone it is a new week a new day of quarantine um i'm just gonna start stretching because for once i'm on time um hello i don't think i know you m janess but welcome to my ballet class i only do a bar um it's generally like intermediate advanced um but yeah i'm happy to have you lee is here yay I'm gonna start with some, just an easy warm up because I haven't danced the last two days and I know that I definitely need to. Um, so follow along. Uh, you can do whatever you wanna do really for your body's needs. It's just gonna be a little stretch warm up to begin. So we can be nice and ready for the bar. So I'm starting with my legs straight out in front of me just to warm up those. Hamstring with laurels here. Just <sighs> breathing and reaching for the toes. Coming up, flexing those feet. Breathing and reaching for the toes. Inhale, flexing those feet. So just gentle as we're just beginning the first few movements. First few steps of the day. Most important is to keep the breath going. And allowing yourself just to warm up, wake up. And as you're warming up, you can start reaching deeper. Start going deeper into the movement, deeper into the stretches. You can hold longer whenever you're ready. And just keep the breath flowing. The breath is going to help you energize. The breath is going to help you wake up. So we'll start warming your body. I'm going to go down and hold the toes and breathe here for a moment. Just let those hamstrings start to stretch out. Gentle in the neck, keep a long spine, keep those shoulders away from the ears, and keep breathing. I'm gently rubbing my body just to create some physical warmth. And to keep the motion going rather than just staying still. Keep breathing, whatever position you're in, you don't have to do exactly as I'm doing. But just keep breathing. Keep lengthening. Keep finding space in the muscles and in the in, in the bones, and in the ligaments, in the connective tissue. Keep breathing. And we're Whatever position you're in, keep those shoulders away from the ears. Let's come up and out of whatever position you were in. Oh, Jeffy's here. And I wanna, hey, I'm gonna do like a crisscross. I'm actually gonna do a double pigeon, but if you want, you can just do kind of like this cross position. Ooh, keep breathing and reach forward. Whatever you're doing with your legs, just to stretch out those outer hips. And just remember to keep those shoulders away from the ears. Keep the spine long, keep the neck long. Keep breathing. Just waking up those outer hips. And in turn, it's also waking up the lower back. Keep breathing. <sighs> Keep breathing. We'll just stretch for one more song. Keep breathing. 
Oh my goodness. Oh, Sarah's here. <laughs> I believe in you, Sarah. You could do it. Oh man. Well, while we're here, I have, I was thinking like, do I have anything interesting to talk about? But I really don't. I started watching The Crown. I don't know that I'm that interested in it yet. Um, what else have I been watching? What We Do in the Shadows. Freaking love that show. Uh, it's the FX one. It's so good. Um, have I been watching anything else good? I feel like there was one that I like actually enjoyed, but now I can't think about it. Keep breathing as I'm just rattling on about Netflix, rolling up. If you cross one way, let's cross the other leg on top. Keep those shoulders down away from the ears. Um, anything else interesting happening? Not really, not really. <laughs> you know, quarantine gets me like up and down. I think Jordan is here, I love you. Hi Jordan. Um, keep breathing as you're stretching out this left side. <sighs> you know, some days are better than others in quarantine. I'm sure you guys all know this and feel the same way. Just trying to stay productive, but it's like, man, I just wanna watch Netflix and wallow in misery. Keep breathing, going deeper and deeper on this side. I'll just be here for a few more. Uh, we'll be here for maybe one more minute and then we'll stand up and go to the bar. So keep breathing, stretching. You can start warming up those hips with your hands just to expedite that process. Let's just do one last stretch. Put those feet on the floor. Forward fold. We've already stretched our hamstrings on the ground, but let's stretch them up on our feet now. Backs of the hamstrings really nice and long. Opening up the back of the spine. Weight's already in the balls of your feet. Um, so this was brought up actually. You'll notice a lot that I'm constantly kind of like hopping a little bit on the balls of my feet, especially when I do tondus. It's just to make sure that my weight is always in the balls of my feet, never sinking back in the heels. Let's plie and straighten, plie, straighten. Keep that neck long, reaching towards the floor, plie. Stretching out those Achilles and straighten. One last demi plie, plie. Let's straighten, let's roll up one vertebra at a time. Let's bounce those heels a little bit so you can already feel that weight in the balls of your feet. It should be as if you can slide a piece of paper underneath your heels at any given moment. It also activates your inner thighs, gets your hips under, so kind of feel that the weight already rocking into the front of your feet. And then keep that feeling for the entire class. Let's, I'm gonna keep this on. Let's do a little warm up plie from first position, left hand on the bar. Tendu front, plie. Tendu rond, plie. Tendu side, plie. Tendu back, plie. Tendu back, plie. Tendu side, plie. Let's go toward the bar. And up, we'll reverse. Tendu, plie, rond to the side. Plie to the side. Plie, rond to the front. Plie to the front. Plie, rond to the side. Plie, we'll stretch up and over. Come up, we'll plie. Rolling up through those toes, find a little balance, we'll go to the left side. So we're just gonna do this to my count and I'm just gonna let this like ambient music play for the time being. Right hand, sorry, left hand on the bar. And we do a nice gentle tendu, warming up the hips, the thighs, the feet. 
Okay, in we go. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, Tendu, plie, and rond, plie to the side, plie, and to the back, plie, back, plie, round to the side, plie, go towards the bar, coming up, we reverse to the back, plie, to the side, plie to the front, plie to the front. Plie, last time, front, plie, to the side, plie, we go towards the bar, coming up, plie, roll through those toes, find a little balance, activating the inner thighs, heels are nice and forward towards the wall, rib cage is on top of the hips, and the shoulders, shoulders are down and back, let's plie, and we'll go to the left side. Fix this a tiny, tiny bit. Sorry, sorry. Thank you for your patience. Okay. okay. Left side. Right hand on the bar. Just warm up. Tom Five, a six, two, seven, eight. Tendu, plie, around, plie to the side, plie, around. Plie to the back, plie to the side, plie, reaching up and over, coming up from the back, tendu, plie, around, plie to the side, plie and around, plie to the front, plie and to the side, plie, reach towards the bar, keep those shoulders down away from the ears, Plie, roll through those toes, find a balance, shoulders are down, heels are forward, weight is between the first and second toe, growing tall, plie. Let's go into our, our ground plies. Okay, we're gonna do our grand plies. Oh, Kitty's here. Okay, let's do our grand plies. Um, same ones that I tend to do because I enjoy this one. Five, six, seven, arm comes down. Eight, goes demi plie and rip. Demi, a uh, straighten, double demi, and straighten, grand plie, a six, a seven, and eight. We go up and over, relax the head, rolling up, nice and slow. We reverse to the back, to second. We go demi, double demi, grand plie, have it up towards the bar and away from the bar. We go into fourth position, demi, Double demi, grand plie, grand quarter core all the way around to fifth position. Demi, double demi, grand plie. We reverse that quarter core. We'll put both hands on the floor. We'll demi plie for four. We'll roll up. We'll find a balance in fifth position. So yeah, just the same uh, plie combination that I've been kind of like adding to and subtracting from. This is pretty straightforward, it's demi, double demi, grand plie, port de core. We go first, second, fourth, fifth. We'll do some demi plies on the floor. We'll find a nice balance in fifth position. So yeah, um, I think everyone here has taken my class a bunch, which I love and enjoy. Um, so I don't have much to say other than try and listen to the music, trying to find new things in the music and with your body that kind of accents the music. So really following the hand with the head, um, really taking your time in the music and really using, really like opening up those hips, opening up those hips, yes. Okay, so left hand on the bar, first position. It's demi, double demi, grand plie, and then portico. Oops, six. 
seven, arc comes down, eight. Double dip. Take your time with the music. Grand plie. Push those heels to come up. Up and over. Relax the head at the bottom. Coming up. Ombre to the back. Nice and slow. Keep the weight on the balls of your feet. Second position. Demi. Straighten up. Double demi. Straightening up. Grand plie. Six. Push up towards the bar. Shoulders are down. Coming up nice and tall. Make sure those ribs are closed. Make sure the inner thighs are engaged. Fourth position. Weights equally distributed between the front foot and the back. Double demi. Straighten up. Grand plie. Push those heels down as you come up. Nice big core to core. Release the head towards the bar, shoulders down, up and around. Keep those ribs closed. Tom, do fifth position. Make those demi, double demi, grand plie. Push the heels down to come up. Reverse the port of core. Reaching towards the bar. Release the head, release both hands. Demi plie, a straighten, keep that neck long, demi. And straighten, we're just lengthening those hamstrings and opening up the back. Last time, demi, a straighten, rolling up. Fifth position, nice tight fist. Hips are under. And let's go to the other side. Um, one thing that I will talk about before we move on to the next side. Oh, Brian's here. Brian. When we're doing that grand port de corps, from the fourth position, the weight is to remain in the front and the back simultaneously. So don't rock it all the way to the front and don't sit all the way into that back heel, um, which is pretty hard. Fourth position is like the hardest. But that grand port de corps, your you know that um, that drawing that Da Vinci made with the man and the positions? Um, that's like our range of motion. And with that grand port de court, you want to be able to touch that circle that's drawn around the man and you wanna, well, or the woman, and you wanna be able to touch every part of that circle. Um, I'm using the term kinesphere, although I'm not sure that that's actually the correct term. But um, you're re you're trying to touch the the most extreme part of that kinesphere that's around you, that like surrounds you at all times. So you're reaching up and around. You do have to release your head at the bottom. You go to the side. You're trying to touch like as far as possible, but while you're trying to reach as far as humanly possible, you still have to have this like very maintained structural integrity. It's that upper body that's reaching, 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 where it, but the weight's still on both feet. You haven't like turned in, turned out. The ribs are nice and closed and your shoulders aren't like reaching up. It's the chest and the head and the hands that are just reaching the outermost points that you can possibly touch. Um, that's all I have to say about port de corps. Um, in fourth position, it goes one way, and when we're in fifth position, it goes the opposite way. So it's the same, the same concept where you're reaching past you to the most extreme, like, points that you can possibly reach. Okay. Okay. Let us do left side. First position. For listening. Six, a seven, and arm comes down. Double thing. Double thing. Push the heels down and up. Up and up. Relax the head. Position. Arm 
arm down. slowly today so I hope everyone's in the same boat um, not like slow slow but you know just like easing our muscles back into the new week okay, let's do something from fifth position I'm figuring it out and then I'll talk it out before we all do it together, but I just want to make sure that I have that music right and it'll be good for our brains. Six. So this is just a mark. Tendu, plie, enveloppe. It goes tendu, plie, enveloppe. It goes tendu, plie, enveloppe. We brush back, up front, up back. We reverse it. goes tendu, plie, at the very end um I'll just talk it out tendu plie enveloppe side back back front back we reverse then we go 
front, side, back, inside leg to the front, back, side, front, inside leg to the back. We do that again, but in plie. And then we're gonna do eight tendus with the outside leg just to the side changing. We do eight with the inside leg changing, plie, just a little coupe. Simple, but we're warming everything up. Make sure you focus on those toes, really pointing at the end, straightening that knee to its maximum capacity. Um, and using the arm because it's nice and slow. Okay, right foot in front, left hand on the bar. We're doing tondus from fifth position. Six, seven, eight, it goes. Tondu, plie, on the pay. To the side, plie, on the pay. To the back, it goes. We brush, back, a front, a back, Close back, it goes, tongue, plie, on the pit, close, tongue, don't change, now it changes, keep the weight on all the foot, tongue, plie, it goes, front, back, front, tongue, it goes, front, side, back, inside leg, to the back, side, front, inside leg, from plie, Keeping those knees nice and turned out. Now we don't go fast. Outside leg. Inside leg for eight. Plie. Find a little balance in coupe front. Shoulders are down. Heels are forward. Find that balance. Let go of the bar. Come to a nice tight fifth position. We'll go to the left side. Six, seven, eight. It goes. Tongue, plie, on the pay. To the side. To the back. It goes back. Back row longer, longer, longer. We close it. Plie, on the pay. To the side. Plie, on the pay. Straightening that knee. Long, 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 long tendus. It goes front, side, back, inside leg. Making sure the weight's still on the ball of the foot. Now from plie. Outside leg for eight. Yes. Inside leg. Balance in front. It's just the toes touching the ankle. Heels nice and pressed forward to the wall. Standing leg is nice and turned out. Release the bar. Close fifths. Let's go to the other side. Okay, sorry. I'm just need some water. Let me take off this water. Woo! some degages. I'll talk it out with the music and then I'll talk it again. So degages from fifth position. Take this heel. Here we go. Front, a side, a back, a side. Front, a side, a back, a side. It'll go front, side, front, front, side, front, passe, turn in, turn out. Okay, so it's pretty like, it's still pretty slow. You know, for me, because you know I love to like go light and fast. So it'll go degage front, a side, a back, a side, and a front, a side, a back, a side. It's gonna go front, side, front, front, side, front, passe, turn in, 
turn out, we'll reverse. A back and a side, a front and a side, and a back and a side, a front and a side. It goes back, side, back, back, side, back, passe, turn in, turn out. Let's do something else. It'll go front, a back, a side, and a side. It'll go front, a back, a side, and a side. It'll go front, back, side, back, front, side, passe, turn in, turn out. We'll just find a little balance and passe. Okay, I don't know that that end part makes sense, but let's try it again. So it'll go, just that second part, it's gonna go front and a back, side and a side, front and a back, side and a front, side and a side, front, back, side, back, side, no, sorry. Just listen, just watch the feet. Don't listen to my mouth doing things wrong. This is the last part of the, okay. Front and a back, a side and a side. Front and a back, side and a side. Just go front, back, side, back, front, side. Passe, we'll just find a little balance and passe. Okay, I'm just gonna say it all together one more time. A front and a side, back and a side. Front and a side, back and a side. Front, side, front, front, side, front, passe, turn in, turn out, close back, reverse. Back, side, front, side, and then back, side, front, side, back, side, back, back, side, back, passe, in, out. We go front, inside leg to the back, side and a side, front, inside, side and a side, front, back, huh, 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 passe. Let's do one more turn in, turn out, then we'll find the passe in, passe balance. I hope that makes sense. I think it does. It's just that last bit that's a little bit confusing, but just think you're just changing those feet every time. Um, and like why we do that and make it quick is so that when you come off the bar and you come to the floor, um, you're ready to do anything and you're really ready to like start moving fast. You're ready for the weight to be changing so you can find your balance easily, you can find your balance quickly. Um, that's like the purpose of changing the weight and starting to move faster with the weight changing and the leg changing and stuff like that so that you're ready for fast movement and finding your balance really quickly. Okay, left hand on the bar, right foot in front, we're doing degages. Oh gosh. 
Okay, let's just do one more fast jeté type thing. be changing the weight a bit more again. So it's going to go degage. Front, back, side, side, up, front, back, side, side, en croix, two, three, four, brush, front, brush, back, front, back, close, fifth, up, back, up, front, two, to the side, up, back, up, front, two, to the side, en croix, two, three, four, brush, back, close, through, close, 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 fifth. We'll do um, 16, in fifth to the side, plie, we'll find another passe balance. Ooh, okay, so it goes. Seven, eight, front, up, back, a two, to the side, a front, a back, two, to the side, en quoi, two, three, four, front, back, front, back, close, fifth, a back, inside, two, to the side, a back, inside, two, to the side, en quoi, two, three, Four, back, front, back, back, front, close, fifth. We'll do 16 with the arm. We'll do, I'm sorry, so the leg is gonna go for 16. <laughs> My nose paper just fell out. And, but the arm will go eight, eight. We'll plie, passe balance. You know what, and from that passe balance, let's find a nice low attitude the long, so it'll be attitude in front. One more time. I think you should restart your voice and movement isn't sinking. Oh, is that for everybody? Is everyone having like technical difficulties where my voice and body isn't sinking? Let me know. Um, if no one says anything, I'm just gonna keep going, but Katie says it's not working. Fine over here, not here. Okay, cool, cool. Just making sure maybe Katie, maybe. I don't know. Okay, cool, wonderful. Okay, uh, let's just try it again. Then maybe Katie, you should like re. Oh, thanks, Robo. Maybe Katie, you should restart and come back in. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so sorry, sorry. I know technology. Okay, from fifth position, I'll talk it out again. Oh, no worries, Katie's. Don't, don't, please don't apologize. Thanks for saying some things so that I know that everyone's okay. From fifth position, it goes front, back, side, side, up, front, back, side, side, front, side, back, side, front, back, front, back, close, fifth, up, back, inside, two to the side, and back, inside, two to the side, on top. Oh, Kai Kai, no, down. I don't know if you can see his cute little face, it just popped up over the side. Uh, back, front, back, oh, you know, you can hear. Then it goes 16, the arm's gonna go for eight, and for eight, we'll plie, passe, attitude, de bon. I was gonna say it one more time because I got distracted with Kai Kai. Front, back, side, side, up, front, back, side, side, front, side, front, uh -huh. Reverse that, and then we just do 16, plie, passe, uh, relevé, de bon. Attitude, de bon. Okay, right foot in front, left hand on the bar. Uh, quick dégages, just find that fifth position as we're starting to move faster, as we're letting that leg like fly like the wind. Just remember it's release and then it's controlled in. So it it has that juxtaposition of that like freedom and then that like maximum control as well. Right foot in front, left hand on the bar. Seven, eight, up front. Oh shoot, I already screwed it up. Up front. That was pretty fast. Let's do the left and then we'll come back and do the right again. So we'll just do, we're gonna do the left right now. Don't worry, we're gonna repeat it. Okay, left side, left foot in front, right hand on the bar. 
six, seven, eight. One breath, and let's do the left side. Okay, right hand on the bar, left foot in front. There are so many like corrections that I have for that step, but I'm just not going to it right now. <sighs> okay, let's do some round of jumps. Oh, yeah. okay, have a good one, you guys. I said, I was like, oh, I'm taking it slow. And then of course I'm like lightning fast. <sighs> okay. Round of chance. <sighs> Five, six, prepare seven, eight. It's gonna go round of round, ton lie, ton lie. It goes round of round. On the A through that fourth, through the fourth. It's gonna go double, brush off the floor, double, brush off the floor. It's gonna brush front, brush back, on the pay, develop pay, we reverse to the back, uh, back, moving through the fourth, through the fourth, it goes wrong. Oh, uh, wrong, through the fourth, through the fourth, it goes double, brush off the floor, double, Brush off the floor. Uh, brush to the back, brush to the front. On the pay, develop pay. We'll do a nice deep lunge. We'll hold it here for a moment. We'll pick up that back foot to stretch out that quad hip flexor. We'll come up, find a nice combre. Let's just go to a little arabesque balance. Can be low or can be high, close fit. And we'll go to the other side. So, um, Tips. Um, the rangeant, it's the toes that bring your foot around. So your toes pushing are moving the leg to the side. Through those um, tonglies, we're moving through that fourth position. So 
it can be nice and big, bigger than if we were just doing a ground plie and forth, because you really want to like reach, but even though you're reaching and taking space, don't let those knees turn in at all. They have to be nice and turned out as if we were in our normal fourth position. Um, also going through the toes, going through the toes, which also translates to every other part of the step. Um, yeah, so just really focusing on those toes. The double rangeons, it's just like a quarter and then you do a full. So double, it's just a quarter and then the full. Quarter and then the full. So you're not trying to do two really big rangeons like in the same amount of time. It's just quarter and around. Quarter and around. That's what a double rangeon is. And to the back, it's the same thing. Quarter, full rond. Quarter, full rond. And you have to think about those feet. Even though it's moving faster, you have to make those toes get you around. The toes get you around. I'm just gonna repeat the step one more time because I talk so much. Rond, rond, ton lie, ton lie. It goes rond, rond, ton lie, ton lie. Double brush off the floor, double brush off the floor, brush, a brush, envelope, develop, we reverse. Ron, ron, through, through, ron, ron, through, through, uh, double, around, oh, sorry, double, brush, double, brush, 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 envelope, develop, we'll do our stretch with the inside leg lunge down, we'll come up, just do a little combre and find a balanced arabesque with that inside leg up. Right foot in front, left hand on the bar, Ronde Jambes. You know I love Ronde Jambes, so really like dance and out. Dance it out. Okay. Six, prepare seven, uh, eight. It goes one. Through the fourth, really turn out those knees. Use the toes. Brush off the floor. Toes, brush off the floor. Brush, straighten that knee. On the pain, develop pain, we reverse. Through the fourth. Stretch, stretch. Through the fourth. It goes, brush, brush off the floor. Brush off the floor and brush, a brush, on the pay, develop pay, inside leg, stretch. Just putting the knee down, picking up that back foot to stretch out the quad and hip flexor. Let's release. Up, it's this right cheek that gets you up. Just a little combo right back, no weight on that back foot. You can pick that up, you can side piece with your under. Just a nice little arabesque balance. Put that inside leg up. Keep those shoulders down, fingers in front of your nose. Nice and straight behind the knees. Growing taller, close nice tight fits. Let's plie and look out at the audience. Cheek is offered, butt's under, weight still on the walls of your feet. Ribs are in, abs are in, in, shoulders are down your back. And keep a little bit of room between your fingers and your hips. First, um, low fifth position with the arms isn't touching the legs. It's up enough so that there's room for your tutu. And let's relax. Let's go to the other side. Actually, just give me like one second before we go to the left. <sighs> okay, we'll go to the left shortly after I've had a sip of water. <sighs> okay, left side, left foot in front, right hand on the bar. Okay, Ron Shams. Oh, wrong foot. I'm gonna push this back a little so maybe you can see my legs better. Okay, left hand, left foot. 
Prepare seven. Weights on the balls of your feet, ribs are in, abdominals are in, shoulders are back. Relax. Okay. Oh, um, let's do something kind of slower like that. I guess I am moving much more slowly than usual, but it's kind of nice. It's the first day of the week for ballet at least. Uh, okay. Uh, let's see here. What shall we do? Let me figure out this step while I'm figuring it out. Um, yes, make room for the tutu. While I'm figuring it out, feel free to stretch. No, stretch while I'm figuring out this next step. Make sure you're breathing and drinking your water. We'll probably only do one last step because I'm moving so slowly today. That's okay. So keep stretching, keep breathing while I figure out this combination. Okay, so it's gonna be an adagio. Uh, so let's do it with the music. Well, let's mark it together with the music because you know how I get. It's gonna develop page to the front, to the side, to the back, brush through to the front, Close fifth, let's go over, rolling it up, through the back, let's go to the side, flip, planche, coming up, it goes, developing front, to the side, to the back, brush through to front, closing fifth, Goes over, come to the back, passing side, right hip, palm shape, coming up. Okay, so that's it. Develop it to the front, passe to the side, passe to the arabesque, brush through, fondue devant, close fifth. We'll go up and over. Nice combo to the back. Passe. Alice Cone. Fuete that body. 
from the second, you're gonna kind of like do like a three quarter fuete where you're gonna go like into the bar, penche, come up, we'll go on the left side. It goes develop, develop, to the back, brush, fondue devant, nice and high, close fit, cambre, release the head, cambre, passe, second, we're gonna, we're gonna fuete by just going up and over that heel, or up and over the toes, they just whip you around from the side, the leg whoops to a, an arabesque, you penche, come up, and that'll be it, and we'll just kind of curtsy at each other, that's it. Thank you guys for being here and doing ballet with me today. I truly appreciate it so much. Okay, right foot in front. We're doing our adagio. Front, side, back, brush through, close fifth. We go up and over to the back, second, fuete, penche. We do the left side. Oh, thanks, Katie. You're so sweet. I think you might be my biggest supporter, and I really appreciate that. Though, I don't know. I have so many supporters, and I just feel so grateful. Let's do it. Okay, right foot in front, left hand on the bar. Gosh, this will be louder. Seven, triple eight. Goes to the front. stretching a bit more on your own just because I definitely didn't do enough stretching with you today um but yeah I'm here tomorrow at 11 a.m thank you guys so so much for everything <sighs> for being here and for taking class with me love you all so dearly toodle pip you're welcome Leah oh I'm also starting to put um things up on YouTube and I'm trying to start some like basic things just so that like for those of you who are maybe more beginner beginning beginner can um be able to like catch up on these more advanced intermediate things so I need to get on that of course but I'm working on it um and I'm yeah but on YouTube I have started posting these classes so you can just look me up Genevieve Xander and you should be able to find classes there okay I'll see you just saying have a wonderful day <sighs>